um, the place doesn't allow um, swimsuit um, bikinis or any of that and Bianca's wearing a bikini top so they dubbed it. <laughs> yeah. Can I have a dollar? Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Bibi DT. And yo, your girl really got her voice back low key, high key. I've been peeped that you like me. I mean, but yeah, nah. That ass, my throat still hurts, but my voice is better. And honestly, it's because I didn't go to La Placita last night. If I did go to La Placita, I would have dead ass had no voice, bro. Word to everything. Yeah, last night I filmed a lit YouTube video with my friends. And after that, child, them shots. Bro, because I was already lit off the two drinks, and then I kept taking shots. I don't know what is wrong with me, but niggas is on vacation, so, yeah. The goal was to get drunk every day. I told myself, you're going to get drunk every day on vacation, you know? But, yeah, those two drinks had me, and then I peeped. I was drinking honey, which I did the same, bro, and then I felt like shit when I woke up. But it wasn't as bad as the mixing Brugal tequila whiskey like i don't know i don't know i don't know so since my friends were out last night that means they're still sleeping i've been up since eight it's like it's about to be 11 now i'm that ass walking in the street and that's what i like about pr though like the streets there are not a lot of cars driving so you're valid to just walk in the street and a lot of this well where i'm at right now it's like a lot of one ways so you could just See, look, one way right here. Oh, shit. Are y'all okay? I'm about to go get some breakfast. At, I'm going to leave where I'm going somewhere in this video. I'm not, like, crazy hungry. I just need to get something in my system. I don't care what it is. Like, I'm thinking about getting, like, a yogurt or something. And some fruits. I just need something in my system, bro. All right, y'all. So I'm currently eating an acai bowl, and this shit is so nasty. Like, what the fuck? Do people really eat this and like it? Like, bro. And I know for a fact, I got it at a good spot too. Like, I just this is my first time trying acai, and I just know 1,000%. I don't like it. Like the acai part is weird. I like the fruits and shit. But yeah, nah, this is not it at all. I don't like coconut, but it's crazy because I want to like it so bad. I don't understand. I really, really, really want to like coconut, but I just can't get into it. It's honestly been raining the whole trip, but I, oh, nah. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, no, absolutely not. Come on, bro. And I think I'm gonna go to the beach by myself too. I'm just feeling a beach vibe right now. But I'm just so fucking sick of the rain. Like the rain really be blowing minds. I don't even understand. <laughs> now one thing I'ma do is move my hips and pelt a little waist. You feel me? You feel me? Cause you got one life to live. Might as well turn up, nigga. Hey, you might as well turn up, nigga. Hey, might as well turn up, nigga. Y'all know what this should make me realize? One. I want to stop dancing soon so I can live my best life. But I need to keep that. Well, I don't really need to. But I was low-key, 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 low-key thinking about getting a job. Like, but I really don't want to. And I like working on my own schedule and shit like that. But then it's like, bro, I don't know, man. I need to figure my life out. But this trip also motivated, this trip also motivated me to start my clothing brand. Like, ASAP, no Rocky, bro. Yeah, look at this bug. That shit was literally moving, no cap. I've never seen nothing like that before. All right, y'all, so the plan for today is we're about to go get some food. And um, I'm really in the mood for a burger, honestly. You want a burger? Bitch, a burger? Eat a burger, bitch, if you want a free fry. Bitch, a free fry. Eat a free fry, bitch, if you want a burger. Bitch, a burger. I haven't had a burger yet. Here, but I'm definitely in the mood for one today. 
Oh shit. This is my shit, bro. Y'all don't even understand how much I fuck with this song. Sunset, I want Prada T. I want Prada jeans. Oh, wait, hold on, wait. Fuck, when it comes out, hold on. Yo, hold on, wait. no sense bro like this nigga really said i am mean to buy that bitch a watch but i bought her one like bro what does that even mean that's not it matter people what's up with your vibe dog watch oh this is what he said this my strategy keep on stacking g's making proud of me i want proud of tea i want proud of jeans i want proud of fleece i'm from property yo <laughs> we're about to go get some food and then try to go to old san juan all right, yeah, y'all. Yeah. So, I feel like this trip, honestly, I've learned a lot about myself and shit. And that happens on every trip that I go on. But, yeah, so basically, I have to sit down and talk to y'all real quick, y'all. But I'm just learning more about myself and what I want and shit. And I just love that for me because, honestly, I never used to take sex serious. Like awesome i've had one night stands and shit like that and i don't really care like it's not that i regret it or anything it's more so like me getting older and i'm just like why am i really giving you my body you feel me i'm at the point in my life where i'm just setting standards higher for myself and shit like that and i think i deserve to do that and i should do that what are you doing for me what are you bringing into my life like just why like, why am I giving, like, I'm at the point in life where I'm just like, why am I giving you my number? Why am I giving you my Instagram? Well, Instagram's different, but, like, my number. I've always been a iffy person about my number and shit. Because I feel like that's just a little too personal. I met this guy, and, like, it was his friend's birthday or whatever, so I was, like, dancing. Not literally, like, dancing for money or whatever. I was, like, dancing in the section. This one guy was trying to talk to me or whatever, but I was kind of, like, I don't know. One, I was really, really lit. So, I was just not really there, bro. Like, on some, so many guys already tried to talk to me. Like, it's just, like, you're another guy trying to talk to me, basically. Like, and... It's like, I already know that these guys just want to fuck me. Skip, skip, so towards the end of the night or whatever, um, I was sitting by myself because my friends, they was like, I think it was getting drinks or some shit like that. And he came up to me and he was like, hey, um, like, what's your name? Like, he was trying to get to know me. And I really fucked with his approach because I've never been approached like that by a guy. And I set the standards for myself. Like, he was like, it's not like he automatically asked for my number or anything. Even when he asked for my number, like, I was just like, why do you want my number? Like, what are your intentions with me? Why are you talking to me? Like, just why? Just why? You get what I mean? Like, I shouldn't be, I don't want to, I don't want anybody to just have easy access to me. I want you to work for it. And I know it's probably a little ironic coming from a stripper and shit, but it's like, I already deal with a lot of bullshit from men as my job, so it's like, I really just want to be taken care of and I want to be submissive and shit, because I have to be aggressive at work, basically, so I just want to be submissive to a man and I want you to have good energy. I'm chatting right now, child. I just want you to have good energy towards me and good intentions. Like, I just want to know your intentions before... I give you my number and just be honest about it because we're all grown. Like, if you're really just looking for a quick little fling, let me know that. I'm probably not going to agree to it, but at least don't waste my fucking time because I don't want to waste my time or energy. Moral of the story is, I'm supposed to be linking up with him later tonight to get drinks and shit because there's this spot. It's called Eater Rooftop Lounge. And when I tell you, it was so beautiful. Like, oh my God. Oh my God, they had a pool and everything. Oh my God, the views. 
it was just giving everything it needed to give and people were dressing up there so I didn't really go in appropriate clothing but now I already have a fit in mind that I wanted to wear for so long like y'all don't even understand unfortunately though I called them and they said they don't have food tonight but um they have drinks so honestly I'm still gonna dress up and get drinks cuz fuck it I'm gonna just make sure I eat before and I'm gonna try to still go to La Placita cuz tonight's our last night here so we're gonna make this shit count and we're not leaving too early tomorrow too which is great we don't gotta wake up early or nothing like that and yeah I'm going to talk to y'all in a few. I'm about to go get ready. All right, y'all. So this is day four of Puerto Rico. This is my outfit from Diva Boutique Fashion Online. It's this cute little set or whatever. You know, I got a little cheek out, cheek out. And then I have my Toy Birch Black Slides. So, y'all. Yeah, 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 yeah. Strawberry, but they, they told me I started the shit, they just told me they, they ran out. So that's fine, thank you. Yeah, I'm always gonna find All right, y'all. So we are still at the restaurant. Okay, it's yo, these I'm never paying to do, bro. I promise you, I'm gonna be on my independent shit because so that don't look like him. One, it's just important to be self sufficient, bro. That's very true. Like, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I can't wait to get back. You see how this is my first time, like, doing my hair. I can't wait to get back no, and like not. practice on my brothers. Like you. you have to know yeah. how to do these things. When I have you kids, have to exactly. Work. I'm just not gonna know how to do hair. Are you crazy? Are you exactly, bro. Yeah. Anyways, I was saying that I'm gonna learn how to do my own hair and stuff because one, when I move, if I'm still dancing, which I really hope I'm not, bro. Like I want to stop this so bad. Actually, no, I lied. I don't want to stop this so bad because. It's just, I just need to start my clothing brand, that's all. I want to feel like I'm doing more with my life, and I'm just getting older, and I want to do everything I said I was going to do. Subscribe to my channel. Thanks. By the time I watch this, I'll already be at 500. So, that's pretty exciting. Manifestation. The food was, um, it was mid to me respectfully but it's okay the only restaurant that really slapped to me was um the very first one that i went to but then the second time i went the food was mid so it's like bro but puerto rico has really good bread i'll tell you that the best bread and yeah we're about to go to old san juan and then the beach Bros with immunity. Can't beat them, that shit ain't gonna ruin me. I'm the only one now that I do me. 
I got hoes by the crew tryna do me. My life like a movie, get hit in the water. Don't got put in no work, guys in order. This shit ain't got serious, the millions come flurry. I'm leaving by more, we swipe me, keep it no word. This story, I'm young and I'm turning. I got bitches good lord. My bitch, my wood cost two fifty, I'm spurting. Got five million cash, just in case if you merging. My young niggas still get away, they be purging. It happen like this, I ain't do it on purpose. I'm working my move, nigga. Who want you working? I turned on my crew, bought a coupe off a version. I'm tired of these strippers, I'm pouring that dirt. Send dollars and dinners, you smarter than I finish. I told you be with it. My word is like gold in my city. I tell them to go, they gon' get it. I heard that you froze when they hit it. Putting these hoes in the business, you know that you tripping. I tell them no, they gon' listen. Knowing these niggas be sweet and some bitches, I'm different. She tryna leave me, I'm low down. I ain't with savages, don't bring your own round. I'm going bougie, I'm switching my profile. All of my cars get delivered with no mouth. They think they do when we don't, I don't know how. Run through the low, car, the plug, I need more pounds. I put on trip every day from the floor. I'm getting sick of this shit, post some more. Yeah. Baby, ya yo me enteré, se nota cuando me ve. Ahí donde no has llegado, sabes que yo te llevaré. Y dime qué quieres beber, es que tú eres mi bebé. Y de nosotros quién va a hablar si no nos dejamos ver. Yo sé todo el chavo, sé pulgar y cuando te lo quito, tú te lo pari. Las copas de vino, las libras de mar y estás bien suelta. Yo te safari, tú me ves el culo fenomenal. Pa' yo devorarte como animal, si no te has venido yo te voy a esperar. En mi camino voy a celebrar Baby, a ti no me pongo Y siempre te lo pongo Y si tú me tiras Vamos a nadar el hondo Si por mí te lo pongo De septiembre a tonto En mi cintona lo que digan Tu amiga y el de la entera Se nota cuando me ve Ahí donde me ha llegado Sabes que yo te llevaré Dime que quieres pegar Que tú eres mi bebé Y nosotros que me va a hablar La placita over your body, <laughs> <laughs> and that just goes to show how lit it is there. Because is. how y'all put that shit over bro, food, bro? It's not even lit. It's like the experience itself. Like it's not like it's something crazy out of this world, but it's just the experience. Like the fact that you could dead ass dance on the rain and still be yeah, happy, like bro, that was amazing. That was yeah, a whole, that was my high, that was the that. highlight of the trip for me personally. Dancing in the rain and not giving a fuck. I didn't want to thought you were gonna freestyle, bro. Well, I was gonna freestyle, and now they 
you're recording, bro. We're aligned. I was gonna say, you see, oh my god, so far. Let me just do the first time. Oh my god. It was like, I was gonna be like, uh, bro, you're an influencer because you are her. Whoa. That was that was literally gonna be it. Now you're recording. Book me, studio session. No. Um, I charge. No. I charge 70k a feature. You. <laughs> All right, yeah, book my friend. Um, the place doesn't allow um, swimsuit um, bikinis or any of that, and Bianca's wearing a bikini top, so they dubbed it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so now we're gonna find a new place to eat, but still, you know, um, yeah. Here we are. Just so we can figure this out. All right, y'all. So we are currently at Chloe Condado, and. Um, yeah, it's actually really nice in here. It's just cold. Oh my god, I get cold so easily. It's not even funny. Song, I thought this was another song. But, um, yeah, I just ordered like a homey meal. Like rice and beans, avocado, shrimp, and sweet plantain. That's what I got. Thank you, Samsara. Yeah, I knew it. Which yeah, one? I have it in black. You have it in black? <laughs> Damn loose. Can I have a dollar? Hey. And this is living life, baby. because I'm capturing your reactions very well. Oh. Like, look at this. Shot o'clock. Uh, you guys, it tastes good. I know it's great. It does taste good. He didn't. Ooh. Shot o'clock. Shot o'clock. Shot
I just wanted to say y'all. Uh, I just wanted to say y'all. Uh, I'm literally naked right now, about to skinny dip. We outside.